السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته ورمضان مبارك الحمد لله الله سبحانه وتعالى has blessed us tremendously in Ramadan he's blessed us with the Quran he's blessed us with deputing our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam as the final messenger to humanity one of the verses that Qari Amar recited, join these two together, the Qur'an and the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam A'udhu Billahi Min Ash-Shaytan Ar-Rajim Bismillahi Rahman Rahim Alhamdulillahi Alladhi Anzala Al-Furqan Ala Abdihi Liyakun Lil Alameen Nadira Alhamdulillahi Alladhi Anzala أنزل الفرقان على عبده ليكون للعالمين نذيرا. All praises due to Allah has revealed the criterion, the Quran, which is a great, the greatest source of ethical guidance. The Furqan, the criterion to distinguish right from wrong, in order that he will be a warner to all the worlds. لِيَكُونَ لِلْعَالَمِينَ نَذِيرًا صلى الله عليه وسلم So, Alhamdulillah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has blessed us to be the recipients of that warning or those who respond to that warning. And He's given us glad tidings also, صلى الله عليه وسلم So He's warned us, we have to warn the people. He's warned us, we have to warn the people. And to warn the people, we have to ourselves be committed to the guidance of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. فَاقِدُوا شَيْءٍ لَا يُعْطِيهِ When lacking something, can't give it to others. So at a time the world is crying out for to know the right path concerning relations between nations and tribes. And some people might say races, races. If we are bogged down in tribalism and racism and the things that the world needs from us, then we're, we're not in a position to warn the people. We're not in a position. If we're bogged down in materialism, consumerism, and we're acting like the brothers of shaitan. Those who squander and waste, they are the brothers of Satan. We're not in a position to warn the people. If, if, we're, if we're so caught up in the world and the dunya, then we're not in a position to say to the people, as, as the Prophet said, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Say to them, say to who? The, the people who rejected the message because they were so wrapped up in their dunya. So, so they're so busy trying to get everything they could gather from the dunya that they didn't have time for the message. They didn't have time to listen. They didn't have time to give everything they had. We're, we're, we're told to give, give it all to the best of our knowledge and ability. Oh, you believers. Ya ayyuhaladina aman, udhkhulu fi silmi. Enter into Islam. Katha. Totally. Totally. Wala tatib'u khutuwat shaytan. Don't follow the footsteps of Satan. What's that? Does it follow in the footsteps of Satan? Don't, don't follow the footsteps of Satan. In his materialism, like he he valued him, he 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 saw himself superior to Adam alayhi salam because of material things, 
his physical composition. When Allah Ta'ala addresses him, مَا مَنَعَكَ إِلَّا تَسْجُدَ إِذْ أَمَرْتُكَ قَالَ أَنَا خَيْرٌ مِّنْهُ خَلَقْتَنِي مِنْ نَارٍ وَخَلَقْتُهُ مِنْ طِينٍ I'm better than him. Why are you better? What, what prevented you from prostrating yourself? When I commanded you to do so, he said, I'm better than him. Based on what? Based on his intellect? Based on his moral fiber? Based on his, his piety? None of these extra physical characteristics he referenced Based on his physical composition, You made me from fire while you made him from clay. Based on his color, you burn wood, is orange. You burn some things, you burn the gas coming out of your stove, is blue. Whatever you burn, it has a color. Use a nice color. So, Based on my fire, my color, you made him from clay. So based, based on my physical composition, based on my color, what color was the clay? It was black clay, the, the dominant opinion. This is black clay. My blue, my orange, my yellow, Sometimes the, the blue has white in it. It's better than his black clay. So we're following shaitan and his racism. We can't enter completely into Islam. Or the whole of Islam, the kafta. The prophet in it totally. So we, we can't arise to his level, but we try to approximate it. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Because he entered totally, he was fit to be a warner. Anzala ala abdihil furqana liyakuna lil alameena nadira in order that he would be a warner to all the worlds. So may Allah bless us to, to escape all of those things that prevent us from total submission so we can be warners. Al ulama'u wa rafatul anbiya the scholars are the heirs of the prophets. And in the absence of the prophets, the scholars guide and warn their ummah and condition their ummah to undertake the work of the prophets. <laughs> o you believers, obey Allah and obey the Messenger. And those in authority amongst you, وَأُولِ الْأَمْرِ مِنْكُمْ الْعُلَمَاءُ وَالْأُمَرَى The scholars and the legitimate leaders. And if there are no legitimate leaders, الْعُلَمَاء So we, we have a mission. We, we, can't, we can't live like other people. يَا نِسَاءَ النَّبِي O you wives of the Prophet, you're not like other women if you're mindful of Allah. And, and just as so, you, the other women, they want to haggle about oh, what they have and what the husband didn't get them and this thing and when they're going to take go shopping. and That's not your job. You're the wives of the Prophet. And the same applies for the Ummah. Those, those petty things that they're totally wrapped up and engrossed in that keep them from submitting to Allah, that's not appropriate for us. That's not appropriate for us. Say Allah, then leave them in all their play, in their sport, in their frivolousness, in their emptiness, in their vacuousness. ثُمَّ ذَرْهُمْ فِي خَوْضِهِمْ يَلْعَبُونَ قُلِ اللَّهِ وَالْحَمْدُ لِلَّهِ We have the believers in the masjid crying out to Allah. 
And these nights of Ramadan, these nights culminating with Laylatul Qadr is the hujjah of Allah against the angels and against the shaitan and against the belief, the, 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 the beliers, the disbelievers. Because they, they, they say these humans and when your Lord said to the angels, I'm going to create a vice German in the, in the, in the earth. They said, will you place therein? Tajalu fiha, man, the one who will work corruption. Yufsidu fiha, and shed blood. While we glorify your praises and extol your sanctity. Qala inni a'lamu ma la ta'lamu. I know what you know not. I know the potential of this human. Yes, there's a small minority of them. They're going to shed blood. No one's here shedding blood. But the majority of them, they're going to have the potential to voluntarily worship me. They're going to have the potential to give up their sleep and to give up their food and to give up their drink for my sake. They're going to have the potential to worship me and govern and, and glorify me and, and, and pray and stand in prayer for me on the top of the rubble of their homes and the rubble of their schools and their hospitals and their universities like they're doing in Gaza. Ramadan didn't stop. They're going to have the potential when they're half starving to fast. I created this human and I know his potential. I know her potential. Yes, there, there's in them that the, the, the minority is reflective of that little fire that Allah put in our, our, in, in our clay, in our water, which, which pulls us to the angels, the light in us. There's a little fire. Shaitan. So the, the, the jinn, that's their nature, is the fire. And the humans, their nature is the clay. But there's some fire in them that gets exploited by shaitan. But that, that, that minority, that little bit of fire reflects the little bit of wicked evildoers amongst humanity. This is reflective of that. But most of them, they're going to fill up the masajid. They're going to sacrifice their sleep. They're going to sacrifice their food. They're going to, they're going to, to, to do everything in their power to, to, to rescue and to assist and to tell the story of their brothers and sisters who are suffering here or there. That's the human. May Allah bless us to, to find that humanity with our, within ourselves. May Allah Ta'ala bless our prayer and our fasting and our, our charity. It's Ramadan. Men Sama Ramadan, fast in Ramadan. Men Qama Ramadan stands for prayer and worship during the nights of Ramadan. كان رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم أجود الناس وأجود ما يكون في رمضان حين يلقاه جبريل فيدرسه القرآن. And they're going to spend, they're going to sacrifice their wealth. May Allah bless us to do all of that for His sake, for His sake, seeking His reward. إيمان واحتساب, seeking His His reward. Seeking his paradise, seeking his vision, seeking to hear the Quran from him. So people talk about the ru'ya, 
But there's also sama. In Jannah, there's going to be a time where Allah gathers us and He's going to recite the Quran to us. His words. With His voice, however that is. And that's going to be another delight of paradise. And let those who vie and compete with each other, let them vie for that. Sallallahu ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam tasliman kathira Rabbana laka alhamdu wa laka al-shukru Allahumma, Allahumma ja'al jam'ana hadha jam'al marhuma wa tafarruqana min ba'di tafarruqa ma'asuma wa la tada' indana wa la fina wa la ma'ana shaqiyan wa la mihruma Allahumma inna na'udhu bika min al-hammi wa al-hazan wa na'udhu bika min al-ajzi wa al-kasal ونعوذ بك من الجبن والبخل ونعوذ بك من غلبة الدين وقحول الرجال ونعوذ بك يا الله من عين لا تدمع نعوذ بك يا الله من عين لا تدمع من عين لا تدمع ومن قول لا يسمع ومن قول لا يسمع ومن قلب ومن نفس لا تشبع ومن نفس لا تشبع ومن نفس لا تشبع من دعاء لا يرفع ومن دعاء لا يرفع ومن دعاء لا يرفع يا الله ومن قلب لا يخشع ومن قلب لا يخشع ومن قلب لا يخشع وصل اللهم وسلم وبارك على سيدنا وحبيبنا وقرة عيوننا محمد وآله وصحبه وسلم تسليما كثيرا سبحان ربك رب العزة عما يصفون والسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين نعلم ونقرأ الفاتعة لن يأتي الشفاء لمرضى المسلمين جميعا لن يأتي الفرج لأهل غزة وفلسطين دفة غربية والمسلمين المظلومين مستضعفين في شتى انحاء العالم وصلي اللهم وسلم وبارك على سيدنا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم سبحان ربك رب العزه عما يصفون وسلاما على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين الفاتحه Salu alayhi wa sallimu taslima Hatta tanalu jannatan wa na'ima Allahu yajzihi man yusallihi maratan Yarkaliba wa yaskunu fil jinani muqima اللهم صل وسلم وبارك عليه وعلى آله صلى الله عليه وسلم أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والعصر إن الإنسان لا في خصر إلا الذين آمنوا وعملوا الصالحات وتواصوا بالحق وتواصوا بالصبر والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته